Hello everyone. Welcome to today's video. I'm Jamamio. It is a pleasure to have you here. Alright, so picking up at the start of day 11. Now I just got a, a hint, like a loading screen hint as I came in and it says areas that don't have like a, a designated area are considered low priority by the janitors. So, as you can see, we've got a little bit of a corridor here. We've got all of this corridor here. It's not a wonder these are always dirty. So, let's look at that real quick. We've got a corridor here, so let's expand that. This is all corridor. Alright, and I think we make it to there. I want to make this all one corridor. Whoops, that's, uh, oh, that's waiting room there. I didn't want to do that. So that's all corridor. Let's just fix up that waiting room there. Like so. Um, and... See now, let's make... Oh, so this is the... we. This is where we make the cleaning closet for specific groups. Okay. This is general surgery. And this is a corridor for emergency, so that's a bit of a problem. Well, it might not be so much a problem, but... Um... Got to fix up this nurse's station. That's all part of that one room. Um, and yeah, corridor. Let's paint it out. There. Alright, that might be a bit better. We've still got this area. Um, maybe I'll just make that a... Let's do that for now. Then it's got something. It's not perfect. But at least they're uh, they're done now. So let's have a look at, say, our patients. Because we had a few patients on the go in the yesterday. Um, successfully finish one event. Unlock event buttons. So how do I get my first event if I can't unlock the event button? Let's, holy crap, look at them all coming in. Let's speed it up. Joseph Jones, uh, let's see. Is there any of these we can stop watching now? She's, they're monitored, so I think they're all monitored. She isn't. She. He isn't. Let's monitor on that. 
Alright, and then... It'll just push off that top one. Alright, diagnosing a patient's proved to be difficult. Okay. Um... What have we got? Let's do temperature check. And we'll take over control. Okay. Our poor ambulance guy's just sitting there. Are you ready to go home? Thank you. Jeez, we're not getting anything. Yeah, chest pains. Uh, he's got iron deficiency. That should uh, get him sorted. Incorrect diagnosis. That's no good. He's good to go. Look at that. Lovely. Leveled up. That's fantastic. Paul Williams. Collapsing. Oh dear. He's already there in, uh... Jeez, so... Can't be described in this department. I don't think we... Can we... We can't... So he's gotta be stable. This is the guy we wanna watch. We wanna be able to... Long wait. Oh, uh, and I'm missing some flaws there too. Oh, I want the same as that. A patch. Um, I don't really have enough for another trauma center. Sorry. Robert Rodriguez waiting for a free examination room. Oh dear. I just don't have the money to to help these guys. Alright. Can we send him over there? Get him on ACE inhibitors for that. Pert for that. Jordan Lee? Uh, he's still got more tests going on. Need to find out what's flashing here. It's collapsed again. Oh, this poor guy. Uh, how's he going? Transient therapy? So he needs liver medication, which he's getting. Really intrigued about this guy. This guy's the one. He's just having a tough time. <laughs> He's died! Oh no! Oh, 
Oh, our next one's collapsing. We just can't keep up. Uh, we can pay another twenty thousand dollars back though. All right, let, let's have a look. So we don't need to control him anymore. He still has a hidden symptom. He's just waiting for some liver medication, so we don't need to watch him anymore. Nancy Green. Uh, so we're just... Oh, we still don't quite know what's wrong. We've got a couple of tests there, so we'll keep that one going. Um, so antibiotics to fix that. But... Treat with this one. Let's see. Just the dehydration, rehydrate. And the antibiotics, and you should be good to go home. Trisha Allen stabilized and moved to a responsible department. Let's go. Uh, spleen, abdominal surgery, so we're just waiting. Just that to be done. I think we can stop controlling her. He's still got one. Here we go. So, liver medication. Don't need to control that anymore. And the antibiotics for the bacterial gastroenteritis. Okay. Alright, so we said yesterday that we would keep an eye on our waiting room here to see if we get more people. We're getting significantly more people. What I'm inclined to do is go into our building mode. weird okay gives a few more chairs um, but we did say about another doctor surgery it's four thousand I need to take out a little bit more of a loan to get back up paint this one okay need another doctor preferably a decent one I think acute medicine diagnosis acute medicine acute medicine Oh, this one's got anesthesiology as well. Hopefully that uh, starts to clear up our... Long wait for regular hospitalization. Re requires a ward. Should we... Invest in another ward. Okay. 
Guessing we probably should. Perfect. Okay. So we got some walls that need painting up here. Rotate around, we get some brick. That should be good for him. So Six doctors on the go. Procedures are finished. Last is interview. I think we're good for this guy. He's had his surgery. Sepsis. Uh, we need IV antibiotics. To get rid of that. He's got that IV antibiotics that should hopefully disappear. Well, not disappear, but be suppressed. Something's collapsing. Two hidden symptoms. Can't do anything about that yet. We will follow on. We need those hidden symptoms. No free beds. I don't need another trauma center almost, don't I? It shouldn't be waiting too much longer. Problem is trauma centers are so expensive. 23,000. Let's do it. Let's just lock it in. We kind of need it. Out of money. Can't do a wall. that calmed down. Nice. Get rid of that guy. This guy's still here. She's being seen. She's just a regular, so I won't worry about her. Taken control of that, but we need some of these. Let me try and do that. This guy's collapsing. Needs a blood transfusion so we can get that down. And we'll throw those at him as well. Oh! Another one collapsing, heart failure, hypertension, oh my goodness. Heart failure needs defibrillation. Freeze, I know. <laughs> Can't do anything about it. He
just not a lot we can do right now. Another patient collapsing. Now stuff's going home. Oh, we're in trouble. We got two ambulances back to back. Kind of just got to do it. Oh, my hospital's just chaos. Oh, dear. All right, we're going to have to put in, I reckon, at least another two of these rooms. So that's the on-call room, so we're going to need a new one of those. Five and a half, 23, so we're gonna need 40,000. Put it there, it's not ideal. Do that, uh, we'll just pop in some walls. So... Corridor. So, all right, need to sign you over here, sign you over here. Then we can declass this room. Prefabs, trauma. Oh no, we got stuff in there still. some of these around. This is one more trauma center, but I just want to bring everything down one, but I can't. It's not so simple. Um... That's just a waste right there. I think I've got an idea of what to do here. This, we get rid of this. Bring up manager mode, reception. 
at that. these down there are walls we'll get rid of this wall here room a bit more waiting room space uh, we're in the night shift so we're gonna move you to there that's gonna allow me to move this yeah maybe Who's using it? Oh, what the hell game? the hard way <laughs> all right that looks a little better it's already given us one extra room though which is a little disappointing that's okay uh let's get back to playing i think that's going to be my downfall is the fact that I just don't have the, like the everyone's got long waits for stuff really not a lot I can do about that not with the money I've got anyway They're all just long waits. That's all it is. 25% more patients to emergency today. Oh. Our emergency's going to get smashed. Actually, let's... Yeah, it's just not getting treatment he needs or something. Getting towards the end of day 12. <sighs> Patient about to leave. Waiting for blood tests. Jeez, does this room need to be bigger?
That's just, that's our problem, is everyone's got to wait. Almost sent us, but we've already got four. Regular hospitalization needed. We get two wards full. I, I can't afford another one. Alright, let's. Let's pause it there. This this is a weird sort of playthrough for me because there's no end in sight for this. I'm just going to keep going. Problem is, I'm I, I need I, I'm not getting anywhere with it. Everything is reactive. I'm not controlling anything, and I'm kind of getting a little a little bored with it. And I got other games that I want to play. So, what I might do, I'm going to end this series off here. It, it's a really shitty ending. I won't deny that. But, I kind of want to move on to other things. I did enjoy the game, but I just, I don't, don't feel like I'm fully grasping the balance for things. So I think I need to just sort of spend some time just playing and fiddling with things and seeing where they're at and then move and you know then maybe doing a playthrough where I've got a bit more knowledge of the game so somewhere down the track we may get another playthrough and what we'll do in that one is we'll we'll set a goal um I came into this one and I didn't really know what I was getting into but we will end this one here it's, it's been pretty fun we've had uh 10 episodes of this sandbox um but as I said want to move on to some other stuff so thank you everyone that's come through to the end of this video uh i appreciate that uh please hit the subscribe if you're uh hit the subscribe button if you if you feel like it no pressure uh socials will be in the description below and i will see you tomorrow with a new game what will it be what will it be <laughs>